Let's start by reading the question and see what they want from us. The student wants to emphasize a similarity between the two ways a magnificent frigate bird acquires food. So a similarity uh, in the ways it acquires food, two ways. Okay. So the magnificent frigate bird is a species of seabird that feeds mainly on fish, tuna, squid, and other small sea animals. That doesn't say how it gets food, so that probably doesn't matter. It is unusual among seabirds in that it doesn't dive into the water for prey. So mm, saying it, what it doesn't do, but the question really kind of wants what it does do. One way it acquires food is by using its hook-tipped bill to snatch prey from the surface of the water. So hook-tipped bill, uh, surface of the water. Another way it acquires food is by taking it from weaker birds by force. So weaker birds by force. This behavior is known as kleptoparasitism. Cool word. Um, okay. So what's the similarity? Mm, I don't know. Snatching? Taking? Snatching? I don't know. I don't know what the similarity is. So let's go to the choices and see if it tells us. Um, a, a magnificent frigate bird never dives into the water, instead using its hook tip bill to snatch prey from the surface. Well, that's saying one of the ways, right, the bill, but again, it, the diving into the water is not a way, it's, it's what they don't do. So why would I want to talk about that? That wasn't part of the question. Neither of a magnificent frigate bird's two ways of acquiring food requires the bird to dive into the water. Interesting. This is, this is weird. Maybe that's right. It's a little sneaky way of, of kind of checking the boxes, right? But let's think about what the question wanted, right? It wanted us to talk about the two ways. Well, um, it does, right? It specifically says two ways. What's a similarity? Similarity is that in neither case is it going into the water. It's weird. I get it. I don't know. It's weird. Well, let's, keep, let's look at the other choices. C, of the magnificent frigate birds, two ways of acquiring food, only one is known as kleptoparasitism. So it does talk about the two ways, but notice it's not a similarity, right? Only one is known as this kleptoparasitism. So it's it's saying there's a difference, right? The, the, there, there's one that's called this and the other is not, so they're making a difference here. So that's not good. Uh, in addition to snatching prey from the water with its hook tip bill, a magnificent frigate bird takes food from other birds by force. I mean, it's mentioning the two ways, but why are they similar then? It's just saying that in addition to this, it does this other thing. Um, one is snatching, one is taking. I don't think that's a real similarity. They didn't really present it as such. Uh, it's one's taking it from the water, one's taking it from another bird. So I don't know, this doesn't seem right. I, I think this is a, a trap because it's explicitly mentioning the two ways. And so you might think that that's right, but it's not saying any way in which they're similar. Now B is doing that. It's doing it in a way that you'd probably be less likely to notice because it's a, a similarity in that they're both not this other thing, right? So there's almost like three ways and we're getting that A and B are similar because neither A nor B is C. That's bizarre. But it fits the bill. So here's the thing is because we paid attention to the question, choice D, which is definitely a trap, doesn't really feel like a very compelling answer to me. I knew I wanted a similarity. I just, I'm not getting that here. So those little connector words in the question really do matter. We're looking for certain facts to be presented, but much more important is kind of like the connection between the facts. And not every question does this, but a lot of them do. And so you really need to get in the habit of noticing when they're trying to really focus on the connections between facts and not just the facts themselves.